what's going on? Go back to another video for a sec. I was just gaining it, which is here with the new and improved crusher. I removed the control panel from there. And I put it here, so we've got the crusher, we've got the lights, lights currently on, as you can see. And I'm gonna show you what I do with this crusher. And I'll explain my inventory set with the diamonds as well. So if we come behind here. Well, for the last I, I kinda used a lot of space with the other, with the old um old crusher and it wasn't that good. So I opted for a new design. It was well worth it. Cause this one was specifically made for zombies. And it will also work with other mobs. Just it also freed up some of these quartz stairs which I have a whole chest of now. I took the lamps out of there. Mm -hmm. Also, you'll see that zombies will not be flowing through here as they're now coming from above, which is why those are there. Just the aesthetics. You can waterlog them, so we're going to be something, making this like putting some fish in here and stuff. Yeah, it's really cool. Also, put a glass roof on there so you can see them come through. Okay, but yeah, I brought my brewing stand here, the one we got from that village, which is. Something to do with today's episode, if you saw the thumbnail. <laughs> and that's basically just that, just blood. We've got a furnace, which I actually need to take, and my crafting table. And we've got a lot of materials here. I did some stuff on, off camera. I've got, I made sure I got some stone. We could probably get some more, but anyway. I have now got diamond tools. I crafted these, don't worry, I will prove it, and I've got, obviously, oh bed, I placed, a, I made a bed and placed it there, not important, said it is important, <laughs> and I have sleep, so usually, when my, if you look at my mouse, you'd spawn, you'd like, come out here, you'd come out, oh, don't want to be doing that, you'd come out around here, but I placed this block so you don't, okay, so you would just end up there. Every time, every single time I've tested it, it's proven it works. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna catch you when we get back to the base because oof, still quite a bit of a walk made it across there. <laughs> okay, so I'm back at the base now, and as you'll see, if I can find my diamonds, jeez, where'd I put my diamonds? Don't tell me I've, I didn't use them all now. Oh, yeah, I've got that from the uh, mob spawner, I repaired it at the time. Oh yeah, I also made these. Ah, uh, uh, I think I used up all my diamonds. Yeah, well, we used up all the diamonds, I think. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we used up all the diamonds to make this stuff. Mm -hmm. And I also, we made this in the last episode to finish off. I finally got that last one, so now we are getting... Oh, it's not going to show me, but... Well, we do get level 30 enchantments. As there's 15 bookcases here. Alright. So, well... Today's episode, we need to discuss something. What we need to name these. Write down in the description, we need to name these. Okay? But, besides that, what we're, making, what we're going to do today is building. And, yeah. Mm -hmm, building. But what are we building? Oh no, that's a good question. That's a very good question. What are we building? Well, oh, we're building basically a... Um, Somewhere where we can keep villagers to trade with. A trading hall, you could call it. But we need to find a plot, and I'm not not going to give away this plot. This plot is specifically for the um, thing. For the iron, for the mansion, which is going to encase the iron farm, which will be later on. Which is why those are all there. I did take some of the materials. I thought, though, we could use here. Because I don't need it to be humongous it just needs to be big enough i've enchanted these this one took a while to get i had to scroll through some enchantments on a wooden shovel i wouldn't yeah wooden shovel because like, i don't want to waste my wood i need it see so, yeah, uh i threw those away sorry <laughs> but anyway i've got efficiency in it for an unbreaking which isn't bad silk touch in efficiency for i wish i got unbreaking on that one and on this one no one breaking on these, sadly. I'm breaking these on this one, but fire 
the respect was all we got, and then we don't have a grindstone to get rid of it, so. Oh well. Oh, it's okay. Anyway, I'm gonna clear out some sp a spot for us to build, and yeah, I'll catch back with you after that. Okay, so I've now cleared out the top half, which just gonna knock some of these out, but we'll do that whilst we're building them, obviously. I've set us up with a chest here, and a craft table and a furnace. Put put my coal in there, obviously. In fact, I'm just gonna get my bed out right now and just put it down right there. Mm -hmm. What's the day looking like? That's all right. Not too bad. I think we. I haven't really got a plan for this, so I think I'm just gonna start off by winging it. Now, I'm gonna build the walls out of some spruce. Yep, that's four stacks of spruce. Spruce. We're not gonna need that much, definitely. That's another. Four, oh, almost four stack. Almost four stacks. But oh no, we weren't meant to do that, were we? Oh, that's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's not like we're running deadly low on dark oak. We'll just put that over there, of course. Like, yeah. A quick update. I did decide to scratch this prompt idea. Mhm. Mm so I decided to go for this. This was very resource intensive. This, this is gonna take a while. But I think I'm gonna do updates like this. Show you guys. Show it off a little bit. And yeah. Cool. So I've done this much, and yeah, I'll probably show you the next update very soon. Yeah. Okay, guys. So you've probably just seen me now to another build, which is is basically to house the um villages and where they're gonna like where we can enter and it looks all right so the original like the big building is all done that the trading hall's done now all it is is just the um where we're gonna where the villager breeder is that's all we're gonna that's all i'm building right now i uh, thought i'd just add this as um well you're gonna see it so may as well i may as well just like show you the video and not just cut straight to where it's already there alright so yeah well as you can see this isn't the biggest build but then again it's not really meant to be I'm not I haven't shown you I don't think I'm going to show you the um me building the inner parts but that that's all redstone and stuff down there and then it's just gonna be a water stream with an armor stand in the middle which I will later on put a helmet on which is good 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 we'll probably end up filling armor full on on there but yeah that's basically what i build it right now okay
so now we've got that in there. Oh, this bag right. What the hell? My trunks haven't even loaded in. Alright, we're just gonna put these just around here. Just all around. In every gap you can fit. Well, not literally, but metaphorically. Uh, let me get my carrots out. We'll just gonna eat. We are also now. What we need to do is grab our spruce, and we're just gonna place it in there. And put it in there. Place it in there. And finally, there. That should do it. That should do it for that. For the, for, uh, how many? Spruce? We've got four pieces of spruce left. Now we're also going to need to get some of this, we're just going to place it there, there, and there. And that's it. That's the whole thing done. Mm -hmm. Looks good, looks good. Now, I'm going to furnish this whole thing up, and then I'll catch back with you after that. Okay guys, so I've now finished the whole furnishing up. It's looking, looking pretty nice really nice nothing too extreme but nothing like unbearable along with some other stuff maybe not too sure about that but here's the chest full of everything we're going to need for this breeder now there's quite a lot <laughs> you can see i'm probably going to need some more carrots that's the one thing i'm not sure how much i'm going to need and water buckets i've got two so, in there so i can make a water source we have now it. finished the far well the breeder we just need to get our what do you call them ah, the villagers in here and so I've got some stuff here. So I made some stuff here for us. I did have to go mining for some more iron. I have no chest plate. Mmm, that's a big, big, big problem. But I this this half here and beyond. Ignore that for now. It's just this bit. We need to execute a plan to get some villagers over here. And um, I know there's a village over there. So, uh, this is gonna take. This is gonna be a pain. This could be a pain. But we need to set up a rail track that leads all the way here. And by the looks of it, I'm probably gonna be best off taking a bed with me so I can sleep every time I need. All right. Well, that means we need to start. Mhm. Mm I've got my. I've got a silk touch pick here, so I can just break this and yeah. <sighs> this might take a while. There we go. Hmm, let's see. Back. So I'm just gonna lead this all the way up to the, um, all the way up to the village, 
and then okay I'm... so basically now i'm certain there is a um <laughs> a pillager outpost around here somewhere just gotta find it really but we can do that in the, in the next couple of episodes because i need to do it now but yeah and now i'm here I've built the whole thing i've captured a villager right here now it's just about sending the minecart in and picking him up so oh, that could have been bad so now we can just break this right to here like but so now that's done just need to push him just a little bit just to the where we can then place that thank you all right so now we just place that in Alright, so, and then you just get the co- oh. I'm having trouble with this. I think I placed it. I think it's because I placed it the wrong way around, maybe? I'm not sure. There you go. Now that's off, it's going to take the villager with him. We can work on getting our next villager trapped up. Hey, sir. You want to stand still for me? When you next in stand still. There you go. Just, uh... Come here, yeah? Mm -hmm. Just, uh... Just go there. To just stand right in that. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, looks like he's got to come back here. I want. He's got to get back here at one point. You sir, I've been trouble. Ugh. I'll get now I've got two villagers trapped. One over there and one here. It's far more difficult to get, but we've gone. We actually need to get more rails. Mmm, it's gonna suck. We get more rails, but I think I'm gonna start with this guy. Ah, oh, this pickaxe is about to break. What's your ability? I mean, we've got, got a fair bit of life back still in it, but who knows how much is, how much it's got, how long it's got really. It should be direct. It should be direct there and be. Alright, I'll be back with these two guys after I go sort that other guy out. Because no doubt he's made it. Unless that fuel run out. Oh, that's gonna suck. Oh. Oh, well, um. I don't know what to do if, a, if that's happened. God. Oh, dear lord. I mean, it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, we did at one point run. I did run, run out of my. Of Rails. I did have to go make some more. I've used the power rails for no reason. I don't know why. Hmm. Let's just hope he made it. He didn't come back, so unless he got stuck somewhere, he made it. Oh, question: Do they despawn if they're in minecarts and yeah, you know, they're like at despawn range? No, they do not. Perfect. We need to now get that and um, just put that. Oh, wait, we actually need to get that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's a chest, I had a chest around here somewhere, which will allow me to firm, to use that, the thingy on that. Um, where is it? Where's the hoe? There's the hoe. This is the hoe I used, uh, you guys know at the beginning, that chest. <laughs> it's ruined. 
place down the book properly. Alright, well, ding, ding. That. Alright, that, that'll do that villager. I'm gonna... I'll sort this out, and then I'll catch back. I'll catch back with you guys after I... Sorted these railers out so that they lead directly into there. And get the other two. I'll probably just put them there off camera. It's fine. Okay, guys, so we've now managed to put these guys in here. First guy sh I struggled with quite a bit. Probably th me, I saw it. Don't you try to escape on me? Boy, you ain't escaping. Don't tell me I forgot to put one right in the middle. Oh, I can put. Don't tell me that. No. Oh, I, ha I just have. Place that down. Any others I missed? Oh, he has a crack trade. That's a no. I ain't doing that. I hit I, I hit them when we got when we actually managed to get them in here. So um, was it, it's not the best thing. But we can now put that to the side and focus on the haul we made in this episode. All right. So I've got all the I've got as much material as I can possibly get my hands on for this. I will be needing to make some more redstone lamps, but that's okay. All right. So. I've removed the floor from here, I've removed that now, so the way I want to do this is by um, using some stone bricks, um, I'll put some stuff in the chest, stone bricks, note blocks, uh, um, do I have any good stuff in here, <laughs> and we need the, we've got, we need to turn these into stickies, pistons, um, we need to grab, where did the note blocks go? Had them in here a sec. Had them on me a second ago. Notebooks. Hmm. I think I might have put them. No. I'll have a look for those in a minute. But we need our redstone. We're gonna need to grab our. Have we got spruce on us? Yeah, we got spruce. Um. Yeah. Um. Oh yeah. We're gonna need another type of wood. So for this, we're gonna use dark. No, we've already got some dark. It's fine. Oh, huh. that's weird. Why did I put that in my? It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. We'll do the note blocks thing after, but we're gonna start. I've done some testing with this, so it doesn't look just to make sure it looks alright. And we eat whenever you get one of these. I'm gonna do this. And then let's go one, two, and then we're just gonna break that. Boom. Uh huh. We need to change that to that. This here on the floor, we'll just take that out. We'll break that, that, and that. Mm. I'm actually gonna need to fill that in there. We need to. Break that one only, okay, and then we get our redstone out, place one dot there, and a sticky piston there, with a lamp there, which means if someone went to step, that means if we get a pressure plate quickly, which we're going to use dark oak, I'm just going to get a bunch. 11 of those will do for now, but if we step there, that's going to pop up, which is what we want. Oh, don't want that to go up too far. So when a villager just comes in here, he's going to get in here, he's not going to be able to move. Now I could just do this with path blocks, path line blocks, but I think I prefer this way because it, it makes it look nice. Now I'm going to I'm gonna find my um, note blocks and I'll be back with you. Okay guys, so I've now found my note blocks. We'll just which is in the chest over there. Got annoying. But basically I'm just gonna be placing these in like this. And for this bit it's just gonna be this unless I wanna Yeah. 
I'm just gonna keep it like this, so that it, when they come in here, they're not gonna be able to move. And behind here, I'm gonna place their workbench. So whatever workbench they have, I'm just gonna place it in there. All right. So that's what we're gonna do for these four columns, and for there, I think I'm. Gonna, I think, yeah, I'm for, I'll do one there, like one on each side there. But for this bit here, I'm go. I'm, we got quite a lot of space here compared to there. We can put we can put three here and then three here and then I think it's three. We can put three or two up there. I'm not sure how many we can get up there. But yeah, so I'm just gonna quickly place this in here. Um, I cannot place that. Let me just shift and place it. Shift. Shift place and then put that out. And then what we need to do is get the floor one floor bit done. Sticky piston and obviously we'll do the redstone in a minute. Okay, so then we can get up that there. Right, it. I'm just gonna put my carrots away. The shovel for now, and then when that does that, unless it comes on or something, yeah, right, cool. So now we've got that one out of the way, I just want to show you this, guys. So we're gonna need to come one, two. So we're gonna go from here, one, two, and then I want, yeah, all right, so. We can actually get, we can get more than we th than I thought we can get here. So we can get an extra. That's what that's like. What, four, four yeah, four here, and then so we can go up. Let's do that. Obviously we'll remove that. But for now I need to put that there so we can get our note blocks down. So we'll put one of those on each side. And then what I want to do is just come up again here. Place that there, and then go up here. Yeah, so this is going to get a bit technical, but we can manage. We can manage. We remove that. We need to also remove that. Just going to place that like that. Mm -hmm. Got the glowstone back. We need to place the note block there. No, not note block there. So we can place a note block. Oh yeah. So we place a note block there. We can remove we can take that out and then yeah. So then we have like two up there. To be fair, if we wanted we could put another one there and another one here. I might do that, but that would mean extending this. Meaning less of that. I don't really want to do that. So yeah. I'm just gonna place these in here. And then, and um, yeah, I will cut back with you guys once I have finished building this whole thing. And once it's all done, because I know we're going to need to get some more note blocks and stuff. But yeah, I'll catch you guys then. Okay, so this is looking pretty cool now. Pretty cool. I This looks all cool from the sides, but from the front and the back, but the sides... How's it looking? That's looking a bit odd. Yeah, we're gonna change that up. Mm. We're gonna need some more spruce to uh, change this up, but otherwise, yeah. Because uh, I was experimenting with some stone, but yeah. That has not worked clearly. We only need to change it where the spit is. And I'm just going to change to this. Oh, oh yeah, I placed in some, I made some ladders and I, um, I just placed them in where I feel it's needed so that we are able to get up. The reason I'm leaving this is because we're just going to end up placing lamps there. 
because if I remove that, we can't actually place do the sticky piston trick as it won't work basically. Uh, we need to get the logs down, not the speed, uh, and then we can just change that one. I'll change that one. Why is there? Wait, why is there another? Oh, did I make? Did I, oh, I must have. Oh yeah, I. You know what? I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take that. That is a free helmet. I'll take it. I have no idea where the hell that came from. But well, I'll take it. Free helmet. Out of mind. Probably like a bug or something. Because we are playing in the new snapshot that is currently out. There's probably gonna be another one. The snapshot that I'm currently in, which is snapshot. 20w20b yeah there was a 20w 20w20w which was great and all but for some reason they added that um, literally the day after how is this breeder going is this working there's only one way to trip one way to check any babies in there no hmm We're gonna need to troubleshoot this because it doesn't want. It seems to not want to work. Why are you not working? Hmm. Hmm. I am talking to you, mate. Why are you not working? Why do you not want to work? Hmm. All right. Well, I'll get this fixed for the next episode, but that just means we can't get any villages in there. That's going to be a problem. Because I was really hoping we can get a, um, a farmer in here which can s which will sell us the, um, what's real, we can sell carrots for emeralds because we've got a carrot farm basically because when that guy is not giving them, when they're, they're breeding, this guy's just throwing it down there for no reason so we're just picking it up anyway. Does this guy actually throw it? Does this work guys still? Is this still a working method? Because if it isn't, that's going to be a problem. Right, I'm just going to get down there. Because it's, it's a quick way. That's so weird. This is definitely doable. This works, I know that. Oh, uh, yeah. Wow. can't believe it's not working yet. Hang on a minute. No, because the babies have to grow up. Have they just been roaming free? Is my question. Let me get a texture real quick for that. I think they've been running around free and then just despawning. That could be what's going on here. Because that's not good. We're going to get glass to fix that. But. Wait, that would mean. Because if they've dropped down there. Whilst we were in their build, whilst we were building stuff, that would mean they've been running free out here. So nobody, so I have no idea where they could be. Because if they're trapped down here, that's going to be bad for us. I hear village taking damage. And I also had a dispenser. What? What's going on here? Hmm. All 
Alright, I'm gonna find out what this problem is and I'll be back. Hey guys, so I've now troubleshoot it. I've done troubleshooting and I figured it out. It's to do with the inventory. His inventory is not full, so he cannot start the giving out any carrots. Hurry, we, uh, we've got some supplies, some of them from where our normal farm, which I can just go over there and grab some more. If I really need it, I can grab some more, but yeah, I think I'm going to see, let's get this working and then we'll end the episode off. Alright, I just want to get this working. Mm, no, can't build up there. Let's come up here and then let's just commit. Eh. Take it all. We don't want these. We don't want them. Nope, you have them. And then I'll stop breeding. Go take them. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now is your inventory full? That sounded like a villager just died. Okay, well, his inventory is not full now. Okay, well... I don't know. That sounded like a villager was dying. Hmm. Indeed. I just need to keep some carrots. Is he going to start giving... That's inventory, mate. Doing now. Now I've seen this. This does work. I know it does, cause um, on the Hermit Craft server they use this. The Mumbo Jumbo, he uses this method. This this exact method here. So I don't know what's going on with it. There might. I'm just gonna shove some blocks there just in case. There needs to be blocks there. But, hmm. Yes, indeed, villagers, it is. <laughs> In fact, as soon as we found that weird helmet, let's just shove it on this one. I might get a data pack that, like, allows me to have hands in there so I can, like, do poses. But, yeah. This is so cool how you can't dig damage from this. It, just, it will literally just. It will just put you in the middle. Of course, so if I accidentally like, lose connection with a keyboard or something, it's not going to affect it. Let me go. I need a breed. I need you guys to breed. Gonna take those. Hmm. Alright, I'm make sure this what. <laughs> okay, guys. So we've managed to get a villager in here. I figured out villi the villager was dying here because of these, so I removed them. It was these slabs here. The tag got caught on that and it started dying. So this works. I think we've got another villager coming out soon. I'm hoping. Mm -hmm. Please, please, please. Maybe it's this stopping it from breeding? Because the bed does count as obstruct but yeah so this little contraption here does not work sadly well it d didn't wasn't working for me which was a problem and just put them in here so they were just escaping if they didn't manage to make it through there so now we've got a little guy here this thing works which is great news why that guy was angry i will never know 
the breeding was working. A minute ago, it was working. Maybe they can only, you know, do so much. <laughs> and we'll come down here. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna clean this thing up a little bit more. It's on the sides. Yeah, well, that's the villager breeder done. We've successfully sorted this place out. Oh, yeah, you're probably wondering, how do you get acacia wood on that? For that? Wandering trader? Very, mm -hmm. Wandering trader just walked by. He had saplings, so I just got the saplings. And yeah, so we've built the trading hall. We've got the places where we can do our trading. We can put the villages and get our trading done. We've got the villager breeder now done, which is good, and a little hut to represent it. We've also got a, a carrot farm kind of done for us because we're, we're going to get carrots from this. Are we, we going to witness him giving it? Or are we going to witness him making love? Oh, yes, we are. Okay, cool. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Are they going to have. Are they. Oh, is this going to work? I did, I did go to a creative world, to another world, and I tested this to make sure this did work, and it does work. Did he just, did he just empty his inventory like that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Anyway, I'm just, I think we're going to leave off there. These guys in the background. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's a successful episode. Well. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If you have, make sure you slap that slap that like button and subscribe for more. Without further ado, I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.